Ah, uh, spring break, 1959. Reminds me of my college years back at Ogden University, but that's besides the point. Today, I bring you to Cedar Creek National Park, Middlesex County, Massachusetts Commonwealth. With its lush greenery, beautiful mountain vistas, and friendly surrounding town, it makes the ideal location for any college-age students to make their spring break plans, such as those we will meet in today's episode. All seasoned campers, they will soon find that the mysteries of Cedar Creek will show them that in the wilderness, not only the wildlife can be unneighborly, Oh man, you know, speaking of murder cases, I gotta say, despite the fact that we're trying to track down the Middlesex Mutilator, this cabin trip's been a blast. Hey, I hope your kids aren't causing any trouble out here. The name is Park Ranger Brown. I'm the ranger around these parts. Have you ever heard of the Middlesex Mutilator case? Yeah. Uh, my dad always said, hey Brownie, you can never trust a stranger. And also, you can never trust an Adams. They make up everything. Gosh darn it, Brown. You gotta tell that dumb joke to every single person passing through this campsite. Lighten up a little. Here, have some hickory ham. It's fresh. Good evening, campers. My name's Sam. Hickory Ham Sam is what most people call me. Uh, I kind of live in these woods. Would you like a piece of ham? It's fresh. I would love some ham. I would, oh, I'm good. I would love some ham. Hey, say, mister. I feel like I recognize you. You've been handing out ham. This is the summer of 53. Well, of course, my good sir. I've been living in these woods making ham for as long as I can remember, and you really can't beat it. It's the age-old family recipe. Fantastic. Hey, if your kids ever got to use their latrines, there's a public bathroom a mile down the road from you, right next to my cabin. Just give me a holler. Mister? Mr. Ranger, you just read my mind. And you said it's that way? Right down the road. Hey, next to my cabin. See you later, alligator. In a while, crocodile. Say, fellas, you want to go work in that mutilator case we were talking about? Brilliant idea, Josie. Oh, you kids ought to stay out of these woods. These mutilator is dangerous. Oh, whoa, 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 Brown. Cool your jets. They're just trying to have some fun. It's spring. Let them have their fun. This ain't our first rodeo, Mr. Ranger. See, you know they're going to be safe. But I warned you. Don't you worry about Park Ranger Brown. You know, have your fun, but stay safe. Not too safe, though. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Sam. We had a jet. See you around, Sam. Well, back to the kitchen it is. Hey, guy. Morgan's been gone an awful long time. Gee, maybe that uh, the ham was not quite swank. It's not sitting quite right with him. Maybe the mutilator got him. Oh, Morgan! Good. Morgan! Those, these damn kids. Wait, what? what? Will your kids quiet down in the park? I might have to kick you out. Our buddy Morgan's gone missing. That cat never takes this long on the john. Kids go missing all the time in these woods. You dig? Read the papers, will you? We think he might have been taken by the Middlesex Mutilator. <laughs> I'm not an officer. That's Park Ranger Brown to you. Your kids ought to get out of here. Scram. Brown, would you lighten up a little? They're just looking for their friends. You know what? Kids, come with me. You know what? We'll find your friend. We'll get a search party going. Let's go. Gee, thanks, oh, mister. All right, so what was Morgan off to doing? Going to the latrine? He had to use the John. Oh, I think it was over by uh, the ranger's cabin. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna go this way, guys. Good luck. Uh, good luck. Say, uh, Sam. Yeah? This uh, piece of cloth right here looks awful similar to the one you're wearing right now. Oh! Oh, oh this? Oh, don't, don't you even worry. See, I actually, um... I uh, lended this uh, this shirt right here to uh, Park Ranger Brown the other day. I think that's probably why this is torn up. You know, must have gotten caught in a tree. Hey, what's this? Mister, I found some straw that looks like it could come from your hat or something. Oh, one go. Oh, well, this. Ah. You know, uh, you know, uh, Park Ranger Brown, he's always, he's always got a bit of straw in his mouth, you know, like this. It's, uh, it's nothing usual for him. All this evidence seems to be pointing to, uh... Park Ranger Brown? Yeah. Sam, you know him best. Is this anything he would do? Well, boys, I'm, I'm sorry, but... Park Ranger Brown may not be who you think he is. Wait. Wasn't Sam wearing this shirt? Huh. The police station isn't too far until down there. 
there we can report Park Ranger Brown for this suspicious case. Gee, mister, all this murder mystery's got me sweating. Are you sure it's Park Ranger Brown? You know, I've been ignoring the signs for the whole time. I didn't want to believe it was true. Wait, this is Hickory Ham's pie container. This has got to be his cabin. I can find some clues in here. It's not pork in that ham. Sam, we gotta go or what? Wait, Josie, where, where are you going? Oh, yeah, 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 get in the car, silly me. Guys, wait! It's not hickory ham! It's hickory human! <laughs> Well, it looks like Josie here was not able to solve the mysteries of Cedar Creek in time to save her friends, who are now being sent to what Sam likes to call the compound. Estimated time of arrival? The midnight hour. Thanks for watching. <laughs>